Welcome back to this Let's Play of The Last Remnant. Last time we did a random side quest in order to uh, pick up, a, well, a part so that we could pick up another quest so that we could recruit a character we're actually going to use for a while. If that sounds complicated, well, you ain't seen nothing yet. Actually, it's not that complicated. However, to uh, continue with the quest, we have to do a little bit more uh, cutscene action. And I'm going to have to progress the plot just a little bit more. I don't want to go too far, though, because there are a couple of quests that fall off the radar if you do. I've done... There are actually only two quests that will disappear after the Nest of Eagles. Um, one of which I've already done, which was Balson's quest. The second one is also in Athlum, and I could have done it a long time ago. I just haven't done it yet. Um, and I'll probably do a couple of other quests, um, mostly ones that involve recruiting characters so that for the Nest of Eagles battle I will have, um, you know, something to work with for characters, and I'm not using just really sort of trashy placeholders like Oaks. Um, McGrady... McGrady's actually not that bad, um, but uh, I have some characters in my party who are real... real trash, let's just put that on. And, uh... We're on our way through the heroic ramparts. Okay, this is actually one of the least important areas of the game. There's not actually all that much that happens here. Um, we will come back here again a couple times, maybe three or four, but most areas there are a lot more things to do. This one is just mostly just run through it and be done. There are these orcs, orc guys here. Uh, Janna, I think, is what the game calls them. But... Uh, they don't do anything yet, so. Now, you'll see there are a lot of those items that have the, the sort of scroll icon. Those are crafting items. I haven't actually dealt with the game's crafting system at all, uh, just because there's not anything I've wanted to make yet. Um, but there eventually will be a couple of things that I'm going to need to make. And, uh, you know, it's uh, kind of a pain, but... We'll deal with it. Walking through the heroic ramparts gets you access to the town of Nagapur. And, uh... There's just a lot of cutscenes here. There's also a quest we're going to do for another one of our characters, but I want to complete a couple of the other parts first. Nagapur is kind of an interesting town because the town changes substantially during the course of the story. Um, we won't be doing anything with that yet. Um, but uh, to get to the palace, um, which is where Dave needs to go, Agent David needs to go for his uh, meeting, um, we need to go talk to this dock worker. Be careful. May the God Emperor be with you. Why he's bringing Blockter along, I have no idea, but... Torgal, I guess, is sort of... more intelligent. The, the implication is that Silvani are sort of the, the, the ubermensch of the game. They're, you know, long-lived, strong, intelligent, wonderful, and, yeah, some of them really grind it in your face. And Emma tells you to go, you know, chat up the locals and see if you can find out any dirt on what's going on. And I see someone here already. Oh, wait, that's just Emmy. There are two Emmys we haven't talked to yet, so... Somehow she manages to be everywhere you are. So, let's go to Nordnom first. The guild is here. Um, and the, there's a couple other things that are uh, sort of of interest here, but I won't worry about them just yet. 
Yeah, we just talk to Emma and leave her alone, and she goes back to um, Flussbaum, or Flussbaum, for uh, the next scene. You have to do that with Pagus here as well. I suppose we were supposed to be actually talking to people, but you don't actually have to talk to anyone to uh, make the game progress. Just these, just Pagus and, uh, and Emma. While you're in the city, you can just hit the, the cancel key to go right back to the map. You don't actually have to walk to an exit. Not very useful, but, you know, it's there. May I announce our honored guest, commander of the remnants handed down by the god emperor himself, the gay bulg and Valeria Hart, the Marquis of Athlum, Lord David Nassau! Well met, Marquis. Am I in? Wow. Wish I could get an introduction like that. Anyway. Um. And then we sort of have to continue walking around the city until, uh, the, uh, they're ready. And, uh, that's all there, I mean, you don't have to do anything here in Flusspawn. Just go back to Sudnam. And there's another guy to talk to. And he tells you about the aqueducts, which are another way to get to the uh, palace there. Um, instead of just going, taking the boat. That'll become important later. He's coming! The conqueror's on the move! What? Lord David. Emma, Pargus, rush. We must leave now. What's going on? Where's Wilfred? Our meeting has been postponed. The Conqueror is marching on Celepolay. <laughs> We've been called back as support. We return to Arthlam, then prepare for battle. Yes, yes my lord. lord. If I... Meaningful flower. Arena's here. Apparently, she's in Duke Ermion's custody. I suppose you can rest easy, knowing she's out of Wagram's hands. What? No! Why didn't you take her with you? Well, I didn't meet with her directly. What's wrong? Arena. Arena's got Marion's blessing. <sighs> and you think Lord Ermion is aware of this? Wait, where are you going? I have to go save her! I can't let him use her power! Calm down and think for a moment. How are you to save her if you don't even know where to find her? <laughs> Rush, there is only one thing we can do right now. We must stop this war before anyone has a chance to use her power. I promise you, we will come back for Arena. Fine. So now there are two obvious crises we should be dealing with, and what are we going to do? We're going to do more side quests, of course. Rush. It's not like she's suffering. Anyway, we'll go back to Melfina here. 
and now we should be able to get the second of these two quests. I'm not actually going to bother completing that the second quest. Um, I just need an item that they give you as part of it. So. We'll actually have to do the quest next episode, though, because we're running out of time. But we go here, and we talk to the Knight of Melfina, and uh, he says to go back and talk to Roberto again. So, next time, we will continue with the uh, random quest we're doing to get a random item to do another quest to do... Oh, I'll explain it all next time. See you then!